you're a little introverted. You know you're going to be forced to it's meet a, a lot of people. people and, yeah. and you may not also feel like you're that far along in your career yet. And you want to talk to the speakers. You want to make an impact. What is your advice there, uh, specifically on conferences? Because I know we got a lot of questions from our audience. <laughs> All of these tools that we talked about online, of course, they've helped networking. They've helped us stay in touch with each other. But of course, when it comes to meeting in person, especially going to these conferences, going to these events where you're a little introverted, you know you're going to be forced to it's meet a, a lot of people. people and, yeah. and you may not also feel like you're that far along in your career yet. And you want to talk to the speakers. You want to make an impact. What is your advice there, uh, specifically on conferences? Because I know we got a lot of questions from our audience. Right. And so I think a couple things. One is, you know, remember, you you really don't want to meet everybody and you're not going to meet everybody. So let's just not have that super high bar there. If it's a smaller workshop, you know, there you may have a, a more comfort level with uh, a little bit of small talk with people. But I would say a couple things. One is you're not going to do your whole networking transaction at the conference, right? You're going to make some additional contact that's kind of friendly and kind of interesting for five, 10 minutes, and then you follow up after. So you might be waiting in line together for coffee. Uh, you might be waiting for a speaker and you're sitting next to each other. The small talk there should be a little bit, um, should be related to the conference, the event, uh, and try not to ask yes, no questions to basically you know, uh, how did you, you how, how did you find yourself wanting to come to this conference? Um, what are you hoping to get out of it? Are you, is there a speaker you're looking forward to uh, today? Is this the, a field you're in? You know, if you can read a badge uh, easily, not awkwardly, <laughs> that's great because that gives you a little more intel to go on. Uh, but it's basically, you, you want to draw them out a little bit and, oh, you know, I'm interested in, oh, I know about your company because they've been doing you know something i'm interested in could we follow up could i follow up with you after could we exchange contact info or, or may i you know link to you or whatever whatever is uh, appropriate in that setting and then do follow up you know wait a day or two and then say i'm just glad we met uh here's something i've been reading or here's a thing i wrote or you know whatever it is i'd like to talk to you more about it or just stay in touch about it you've made that contact but I feel alive.